Alright guys, we're back and oh, forgot to set the timer again. Okay, let's well let's see. What time is it now? It's eight fifty seven. Okay, so around eight thirty I'll I mean nine thirty I'll I'll have to uh log off. Or Ugh jeez, I must be tired. <coughs> anyway, I think you know what I mean. If not, then I'm sorry. Um let's see. Equip some of this armor. Right, where were we? We had just gotten back. I have a diamond sword, so I should use that. Um, I don't think the bow, the effects on the bow count um, while shooting arrows. I think they only count if you're actually hitting them with the bow, which is unfortunate. Okay, we have that light gray wool. So we should take that and not lose it. So, let's see. Um... I don't have a sign. Um, just, you know, sign up. Uh, the Estonian battle sign. That's what it is. I don't know. Anyway, I'm sorry if my commentary is a little lacking because uh, I've been doing nothing all day. Um, intentionally. Because I'm. Why can't I hit this guy? Do arrows slow down when they hit water? Because I didn't think they did. But, uh, anyway. Okay. He's not dead yet? Oh, right. Uh, arrow damage is now calculated based off of the arrow's speed instead of the actual arrow. So, um... If it slows the arrow... If anything slows the arrow down, like... Being underwater, then... The arrow will do less damage. <coughs> will do less damage. Which makes a lot of sense. So... Yeah. I'm gonna... Whoa! Hey, buddy! No, you can stay over there. And your creeper friend can, too. No. No. Okay. We got this. This shouldn't be too rough. Shouldn't be. Probably will be. <laughs> okay, I'm worried about an enemy coming from the left, which an enemy is coming from the left. Oh, hi, zombie! Nope, stay. Stay back. Stay back, stay back! I just... Haha, shot you in the face. You don't have a face anymore. How does that feel? Sure, it doesn't feel good. Okay, I can hear a zombie up above me. Which is why I'm hugging this wall. So hopefully he won't fall on me. Okay, I think I should be safe from him now. Okay, let's see. Maybe this is the brown wool over here? Because I know uh, he usually hides the brown wool. I'm scared. University of Arcane Enchants. Fleeception. Quite possibly the work of a capricious conjuration student with too much time on his hands. Ah! Go ahead, shoot the zombie. There you go. a lot of skeletons in here. Okay, let's sprint <laughs> and just start lighting things up. And what is this? Oh, jeez. It's a... Ow! Stop it, would you? It appears to be a giant wool room. What is it? Solid glass here? Okay. Oh no, I think it's just uh, eight times bigger than normal in all respects. So that would normally be a half. No, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, so that's eight times bigger than normal. I'm gonna use the gray bricks because I don't actually have a use for them, whereas I have use for I have a use for uh, cobblestone as you know, generic weapon material. Why is there a <laughs> There's a... Oh, I get why he said Fleeception now. Because <laughs> there's a, a chest room and a chest room. And it is the brown wool. Okay, so... 
That's cool. Let's uh, hurry on down. Hope there's no creepers underneath us that I can't see. Alright. And I think that's it for this room. Uh, it really looks like there's not much else here. So... I say it's time to leave. And we'll walk back there so that creeper can't get through. Let's see if we can't crit on these guys much. Because they die faster. Or not. Okay, come on. There you go. Move! Or I'll just run. Ow! No, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! I feel like there's gotta be something else in this room, but I don't really feel like checking it out. Let's go up here. And I don't think they can follow me very well. Because it's not- Ow! What? Where did you come from? Okay, there's a zombie up. But, uh, let's not worry about that right now. He sounds close. Oh, he's right there. Let's eat up. Unfortunately, I have nothing better to eat than rotting flesh. But, uh, oh well. I've eaten worse. No, I haven't. I don't really want to think about what could possibly be worse than eating rotten flesh. Anything on top of there? No? Alright, it looks like it's just a bunch of stuff. That looks a little lit up. Which is interesting. And there's a skeleton nearby. But I don't know where, which is... Oh, hi there! Did he fall to his death? He did. Alright, let's just, uh... Pillar up. And... Am I just digging right into the ceiling here? Oh, well that works. I can just climb up this now. Oh, or not. Okay, that was scary. I thought I was going to get knocked off, and that wouldn't be good. Not even a little bit. I can still can't see if there's anything up there. Hmm, well there's an Enderman over there. But, I don't see anything particularly special up here. Um, but you know what, let's go check it out anyway. Because... There is that suspiciously lit up area that I'm not sure about. And I feel like it would be pretty stupid to just ignore it. Okay, I'm worried about a skeleton coming over and shooting me off here. Oh, I messed up with the pattern. Oh well. Hi, creeper. Okay, there's one. And creeper? No, okay, he's good. He's good. Nope, oh, not what I wanted to do. Nope, nothing up here. Okay, time to go away. <laughs> it didn't. Uh, I looked up at the ceiling, there wasn't anything there, so that's just from that glowstone right there. And probably part, partly my torches now. But yeah, so there's nothing special. And. Oh boy, ow! My legs. Ow. My legs again. But yeah, uh, I think that's it. This really doesn't look like there's anything else in here. So, I don't see any reason to uh, stick around. And considering brown is usually the hidden wall, um, I'm going to assume that means that he wouldn't hide another wall with with the br brown one. Blah, 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 blah. Um... So, yeah. Oh! <laughs> this must be sea level, or something. Because it gets dark when we do that. I don't know. Anyway, let's try to get up underneath these gas spawners. Because, like, okay, this one is directly above... Nope, stop shooting. It's directly above here. So, if I just wall this off, and dig up...
theoretically, yep, the gas spawner's right there. So let's just take that out. And... Oh boy. Am I gonna try this again? I am. Because I'm not very bright. Okay, maybe we can get him with his own card. Yep, like that. Oh, there we go. And now let's see if we can't get that gas spawner. I mean, blaze spawner. Nope, nope. I don't want to go through the portal. Nope, I don't want to be on fire either. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, dear god. Okay, well, those blazes are everywhere. Okay, I went down ten blocks. Let's try going over here. Yes. Yes, well, we hit stone and... Whoa, what the? That was weird. I didn't open my inventory. I'm just gonna fill this in so mobs don't spawn behind me. And wow, it sounds like there's a lot of blazes up there. Am I going in the right direction? Um, well, I've hit another piece of building here. Um, this is really confusing. Where is out? Some part of this has to lead out, doesn't it? I think. I sound like I'm just getting closer to the blazes. Which doesn't sit well with me. More stone? Which way am I going? Okay, time to dig up. because I have no idea where I'm going. Oh dear god. Oh god. Okay. Yep, I'm definitely gonna die this time. I don't even know how I died there. I had one health left and then I just dropped. What? I didn't sleep again? Are you kidding me? Okay, I need to figure out where I put my bed because this is ridiculous and this is loading way too slowly. Where is my way up? Okay, I think it's this way. Yes, it's this way. The game loads ridiculously slowly when I log when I respawn, which gets really annoying and that spider's going to catch up to me. Get Okay. I knew I shouldn't have gone back in there. But we gotta get to the nether, because I'm assuming that means that there's stuff down there, like... I know there was that nether portal in Picket Panic that, um... didn't go anywhere. But that was just Picket Panic. I mean, this is... This is different. <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like that was a, a test map for him, so it wouldn't have had all of the stuff that a regular map would. Whereas this is actually a regular map. You know what I mean? So. I don't know. Oh boy. So how are you guys? Um, it's, uh, what day is it? It's December 31st right now, actually. So, um, happy New Year's Eve. Uh, I don't have any plans for anything, so, um, I'm just sitting at home. <laughs> It's okay. I, I don't want plans for anything, because, like, I could have gone over to a friend's house today, but I chose not to, because, um, I, with work and everything, I haven't been getting much sleep lately, so I've, I just chose to stay home where I could, wow, that actually really didn't hurt that much. I mean, I understand that these are like feather falling five boots, but still, I was expecting it to at least do some damage. But yeah, um, I chose to stay home because I haven't been getting much sleep lately with work and everything. And it's really rough for me working mornings, um, 
Like, it's one thing when I can get up at 5 or 5.30 and only have to be in for, to work for, like, 6.45. But when they want me in for 5 o'clock, it's just, it's so hard for me to get up. And, or, like, it's so hard for me to get to sleep, I should say. Because the night before, it's just almost impossible for me to get to sleep. Um, and, yeah, it's really rough on me. I don't know why. But, uh... And I just, I was watching over the other ones as I was, uh, or the last two episodes while I was, um, doing them, and I remember that there was food in here that I never took. So, that's where all my rotten flesh went. Jeez. You know what, I'm taking this cake, and this torch can just, nope, I meant to move that up one. There we go. Put the cake here. There we go. Now let's go. And there's a skeleton somewhere. Oh, that doesn't surprise me, though. I forgot there was that skeleton spawner back there. Okay, so I think that's all the gas spawners. I don't see any more. So now it should just be blazes from now on. Giving me trouble. Bothering me. And whatnot. Ow. Oh, good, my diamond sword. Oh, and the brown wool. Okay, time to run. Okay, you can just die. Oh no, take off the feather falling boots. <laughs> oh, I may just die from this. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. I'm dead. Man, this lag is bad sometimes. Okay, are there beds in any of these chests? Is my bed in here? Is that what happened? No, my bed's back in there. It's just, it's daytime. Was it nighttime last time and I just didn't go to sleep? Where is the freaking... There it is. This is stupid. I just need to, like... I need to remember which part of this thing is the area I'm supposed to go to. Because for some reason, I just can't remember. Um, I don't know, what was I talking about? Alright, uh, yeah, I, I could have gone to a friend's house today and to hang out for New Year's Eve, but... or for New Year's or whatever, because, you know, I'm sure we would have been staying up past midnight, but... Um, it's just, I've been so tired lately, and... Last night, I got home from work, and I slept like four hours, and then I stayed up and played video games for a little bit, and then slept for another, like, nine hours. So, that was really nice. And today, I still feel tired, but I'm trying to get my schedule online, which means I should really get to sleep soon. Um, or in line, not online. Um, because working so early in the morning... I need some sleep. And the only way I can get sleep is if I either sleep when I get home, which would put me to sleep at, like, freaking, um, like, when I get home, it's, like, 3 to 6, depending on my hours, um, p.m., obviously not a.m., and, uh, that means I could go to bed then and get my eight hours, which would wake me up at 11 p.m. or, or 11 p.m. to um, 3 a.m. And actually, 3 a.m. is when I want to be up. So if I were to go to bed at 6, then I say nine hours, I'd probably only get like seven, but, you know, still. Um... It's it's funny because like I I would if I were to plan for eight hours I'd probably get like six hours. So ow, ow no stop it. <clears throat> so um because I get distracted and <clears throat> I watch videos when I go to bed like B double O and stuff and uh, or Ethos Lab or Northern Lion who plays The Binding of Isaac but he's actually on vacation right now so there's no videos which makes me sad. But he deserves vacation. He's been he does videos like he's been putting up a video every day for who knows how long, so and even I can't say I've been doing that. So you know, I he definitely deserves a break. Good, I managed to land in a way that all of my stuff didn't fall off the edge. Okay, do I still have the gray wool? I do have I do still have the gray wool. That's awesome. I really wasn't think thinking thinking that I would. Think thing think thing think thing I don't know. But yeah, okay. So, oh, there's this stuff still. These, these, oh, I can't pick them up. 
I'll drop a string. Creeper, stay back. No. You know, now that I think about it, um, <clears throat> unbreaking and, uh, oh, no, I need food before I'm going after that. Uh, unbreaking and knockback are really good for a bow. <clears throat> because, like, you think knockback, well, that doesn't actually work on, um, on bows because it's, it, the arrow shot doesn't knock them back, it's just when you hit them with melee. But that can be really useful because bows are normally long range weapons, but if they get up close then it can be hard to aim quickly because obviously you have to pull the bow back, or, or pull the string back, which can make for difficult situations. But, uh... No, 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 no! Oh, I got it! Now get me out of here. Okay. <sighs> Guys, this is ridiculous. They shouldn't have been able to kill it that fast. Like, because when you get hit, you get knocked back for a second, and um, you're not supposed to be able to take damage within a, a short period of time. And they just all hit me all at once, and I died. So, I think Vex has somehow broken the game just for his little map. <laughs> just to make people angry. Ow. 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 Okay. Goodbye, world. Okay. I figured I might as well, if I'm going to be so low health, I might as well just drop down and kill myself. And stupid skeleton. He's going to hit me, yep. <clears throat> oh, and um, that maybe me... Er, uh, blah, blah. I was watching B00 and Good play um, Legendary earlier, and I realized that most people who... Um, <laughs> who do YouTube stuff have their own skin. And, I mean, I have my own skin. So, that works. But I was just wondering if you guys liked my skin, because I made it myself, and I don't know if I've told, that you, if I've told you that already. And, um... It's just like, because I saw B00's skin and Good's skin, and they're both, like, you know, custom for them. I don't know if they made them or not. Um... I just really want to break that reed. I don't... or vine. I don't, I don't know why. I just wanted to. Um... But yeah, they, like, I don't know who made their skins, but they both have their own skins. I mean, Etho is, um, oh boy. <laughs> Some guy from Naruto. I don't remember which one, though. Like, he's the, he was the sensei guy with the eye patch, but I can't remember what his name is. Kakashi, I want to say, but I could be totally off. So, um, which, I mean, isn't so personalized, but, um... From what I can tell, the majority of the Minecraft YouTubers have their own personalized skins. Uh, and, ow! Okay, that was just stupid. And now I can't take, like, one hit or I'll be dead. This is stupid. I'm gonna have to see if I can't get to that, um, room with all the food, the cafeteria, before I get hit by anything. Because one hit from anything... Skeleton or a zombie. Not a spider. Spiders I could run away from, potentially, but um, they could still easily kill me. Because uh, spiders only do like one and a half hearts on hard mode, I think. <coughs> Easy is a half heart, normal is one heart, and uh, hard is one and a half hearts. And zombies do like four hearts, and skeletons do three, I believe. Um... The, I'm not sure about zombies and skeletons. Like, I don't have s exact numbers for them. Um, oh, good, I managed to make it all the way here. I almost ran after that spider trying to knock him off the edge, and <laughs> I realized that would be a terrible idea. And, uh, turned around. Okay. We have tons of wheat now. So we can just make tons of bread. And pretend like we don't hear that skeleton that's making noises in the background. Because we don't need that right now. Okay. So we have no weapons or anything. But from what I can tell, the blazes and things should be gone. They should have despawned. And I don't believe there should be any more spawners. Unless there's some that I just didn't know about. 
in some obscure location. I need to put out all this fire because it's incredibly dangerous. And if I haven't lost a wool, wow, I haven't lost a wool so far. Which I think is no! No. Where are my torches? They're spawning out of the walls. No, stop. Don't shoot me. No. No, no. Dang it! Are you kidding me? This is ridiculous! Oh my god. This is just stupid. There's spawners in the wall there. And that's that's a sure thing, because I saw that one spawn right up against the wall. Hopefully I managed to light up that one area enough. Where how do I get up here? Oh there it is. Um yeah, hopefully I managed to light up that one area enough so that blazes won't spawn out of it. But this is gonna be rough because if they're spawning out of the walls, then um that means that I won't be able to find their their spawners without digging around for a long time. I mean, once I get into the wall, I should be fine. And this is a bad path to take. I don't know why I took it. Get back, creeper. Wow, okay. I think the skeleton just hit that spider. Oh, oh there we go. yes. Skeleton just definitely hit the spider. Because they were fighting. Um, yeah, those spawners are going to be hard to deal with. And that's a skeleton right there. Isn't it? Can I just see a skeleton there? No? Okay. Guess I'm going crazy. Um, I hate it when he puts things in the freaking walls. Because it's so hard to find them. Like, I believe he did spawn up against the wall. Which means that the spawner is definitely in the wall and not in the... Um... Can I set my... Thank God. Okay. This should make things a lot easier from now on. I don't know how my spawn got changed from here. If I ever did set it in the first place, didn't I? I thought I did. But that's entirely possible that I didn't. So, um... If you if you heard that weird noise, that was my phone. I just got a text from somebody. Um... Because I got a new phone. I don't remember if I told you guys or not. But, uh... Yeah. <laughs> so... Um... Let's make our way down here. And... Ow! Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have grabbed my bed and taken it down here with me. And just, like, reset my spawn over here in this building. Next time. I'll do it next time. Because next time I'll spawn on my bed so I can just grab it and run. Because you know I'm going to die another time. I mean, come on. It's weird. I don't think I died this much in Sea of Flame. And Sea of Flame is supposed to be more difficult than this map, actually. So, um, I'm beginning to think that that's just, like, supposed to be the final area. And I just managed to get to it before <laughs> the end, you know? Because um, that would explain a whole lot here. Okay, so, um, I had seeds, didn't I? Uh, oh yeah, I've got wheat back there, I forgot about that. Um, back at the, I don't know what it was called. <laughs> the something, something apprentice. See note of the apprentice? I don't know what that means. I don't know if that's actually a word or not. If it is, I've never heard of it. Oh, I dropped all my wheat over there too. Oh boy, eating cookies is going to take forever. It's as much as a pork chop. Like, eight of these is as much as a pork chop. Cooked pork chop. And it takes eight times longer to eat. So, cookies are, like, ridiculous now. Because um, it used to be okay, because you could just spam click them and eat them all. I feel like the length of time it takes to eat something should be dependent on how much it heals you for, or how much it gives back, you know? Oh, good. All my stuff managed to land over here. Not over the edge. Oh, oh. Did I just see a pick disappear? Oh, no, it's right here. Okay. Now get out. My cobblestone. Oh, no. I don't want a string. Give me my cobblestone. Okay. Oh, okay, it's just the fire. Okay, now. Let's gather up some, gather up some stuff. And, no. Okay. Gotta light that area up. Oh, sorry. I got quiet. Just trying to concentrate. Oh, here it is. 
Oh, I don't have my pick out. Where's the pick? I need to put out all these fires. Nope. Mm -mm. Oh no, where's my... Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Where's my sword? Okay, I gotta get out of here. Oh, is that a spawner right up? No, that's just stone. Okay. Hmm. This is getting rough. And it's been a half hour. <laughs> Jeez, these episodes go by quickly. I need to start getting these uploaded. What happened to... Oh, probably a ghast. Or a creeper, even. I don't know. Um, let's see. If I want to light this, though, I'm going to need to get uh, some flint and steel or whatever. And I don't really know where I'm going to get that from. Do I have flint and steel? I, do I have iron? I don't think I have iron, or else I probably would have made tools out of it, or armor out of it, or something. Okay, I gotta find this. Nope. Mm -mm. Oh, cool. He didn't catch me on fire. Okay. Put that over already. There we go. Um. Okay. These are two separate spawners. Because they spawned way too quickly. And where did that zombie come from? Okay, I don't know how he died. Or spawned. Because I was like right there the whole time. Okay. I'm scared. Oh dear. Where is he? There, I can't see him because there's fire everywhere. Wait, was that another one? Oh jeez. Okay, well wherever the spawner is, they're within range of in here. Let's see, if they're spawning out here, then it's got to be four blocks back, which puts it at, like, this line here. And if they're spawning there, that means it's it's got to be on, like, this level. No? Where did he spawn? Was it in here with me? Oh, above me? Okay, well then, that, like, totally negates my theory about it being down there. I need to see where they're spawning. Oh, oh that's just... Um. Oh, that's not. Okay. Okay, he spawned from in this wall somewhere. Is it underneath this gray brick here? Okay, well, if he's spawning out here, it... <sighs> Guys, this is rough. And I know we're over 30 minutes, but I've got to find out where these stupid spawners are. Because, let's see, if he, was spawned, if he spawned right here, that would mean that it would have to be within four blocks, which means it couldn't be farther away than here. There it is! Jeez, I found like I dug out every block except for the ones that were right next to that. Okay, now I think that's it. I don't know though, and I want to keep this fire so I can light a wick to the um, portal. Ow, and in fire too. You would, you dick. Okay, because I want the, um, oh, I do have a, there it is, uh, an axe, because I need the portal to relight, and, um, in order to get the, get back to the nether, because obviously I can't get to the nether without a portal, and I don't know if I have any, um, flint and steel. So, nope, oh, that was lag. 
So without flint and steel, I'm going to have to improvise. And there we go. And we have a way down. Okay. So here's where I'm going to end this episode. And as far as I'm concerned, we got a lot done. Because that's, this whole stupid area killed me like 15 times. And I'm glad to be finally done with it. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.